Hi and welcome to Spice Box. Pancakes are light and fluffy. They soak up their toppings really well and they make a filling breakfast. If you like to start your day with a caffeine kick, you will like these ones. Today, I'm making coffee pancakes. The ingredients for the coffee pancakes are milk, sugar, salt, baking powder, lime juice, egg, maida, coffee powder and melted unsalted butter. The first thing that needs to be done is add the juice of half a lime to the milk which is a half a cup and stir that in. So what I'm doing is I'm making buttermilk and buttermilk helps to make these pancakes light and fluffy. So this is a one bowl batter. I'm just going to add all the ingredients into one bowl and mix it well. The maida, three quarters of a cup. A pinch of salt. Half a tablespoon of baking powder. The metal, melted butter, this is about one tablespoon. The egg, which is at room temperature. the sugar, coffee powder, half a tablespoon, and the sugar was about two tablespoons. And finally, the milk, as you can see, it's already curdled. I'm just gonna mix all of this really well. The batter will be thick and this is the right consistency for pancakes. To make these pancakes, turn your flame on medium to high and these pancakes should cook on a low heat. Dollop some butter in and let it melt. Take a ladle full of the batter and pour it in. And let these cook. They have to really cook on a slow flame. You will know when it's the right time to flip when you start seeing little bubbles around the edges of the pancake. Now we wait. As you can see, there are bubbles all around the edges and the edges are looking dry, which means that they are turning crispy. So this would be the right time to flip this pancake. Cook it on the other side for a couple of minutes. The inside of the pancake should cook as well. As you can see, it's rising and it's nice and fluffy, but the center should cook and that's why cook it on a slow flame. The pancake is now done. So we'll just make another one. In goes the butter. and a ladle full of the pancake batter. You can serve these pancakes with some honey, maple syrup, or even some Nutella. But for a really decadent dessert, I would suggest you could drizzle this with some salted caramel sauce. This way, you can have your coffee and eat it too.